good evening, everybody. It's me again. <coughs> like it or not, first thing first, I would like to thank, um, get the name right, Pepper Putt, who, for reasons that entirely elude me, cheered for 500 bits at 7 in the morning. Thank you very much. I was sound asleep, but thank you very much. Quantum World, max 24 players, does not share progression with adventure. Certain account rewards cannot be earned. Oh, so they have their own, they have multiple server types. I am a huge fan, vast fan. I'm pretty vast, uh, and I'm a fan <coughs> of alternate rule set servers. Uh, I freaking love them. I think they are a great, great way to draw in, draw back old players, draw in new players, and keep players with maybe a slightly more niche uh, view of how they want to play. Uh, EverQuest 2 does them, EverQuest as well. And WoW has started doing them. Now, I love to crap on Blizzard. Believe you me, I love to crap on Blizzard. But I also love what they're doing with alternate rule set servers. Uh, I will be going back and playing once again uh, with the Pandaria Remix, I think it's called. I just, I love alternate rule set servers. I think they're a great addition to <coughs> games and MMOs or, and MMO lights, multiplayer games of all kinds. So, big thumbs up for that. And that's the sort of thing that, you know, if it's the right kind of server, can make a non-paying customer into a paying customer. So smart also on their part. And I'm back. Pardon me. <coughs> okay, and here we are. All right, let's see what we've got. Back out a little. That is Vault 76. Not sure why I want to go there. That is the Anchor Farm. What is that? Fast travel back. I can fast travel back to Vault 76. Well, it'll be faster since I want to go there. So... Mm. How do I fast travel back? Toggle active. Okay, that's just... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> All of a sudden, I'm coughing up Chunks of lung. I, not actually coughing up chunks of lung, I hope. Let's see. Uh, do we have anything on the bottom that says what I can do? Oh, fast travel. I figured it out. I'm smarter than I look or sound or the testing indicates. Good evening to those of you who've joined me. Howdy and welcome. And we're back. You should head to that camp. Find the Overseer. Yes. Thank you, Pennington. As always, <clears throat> your assistance is absolutely adequate. That's, uh, I'll, I'll take that and that. I'm rich, guys. I have more pre-war money that I know what to do with, because I don't know what to do with what I've got. We have a new player here. <clears throat> Stim pack and some water. Gold-plated glass. I don't think I need that. Cutting fluid. That sounds like that might be used for crafting. So sure. I'm easy. But not cheap. Let's go to the farm. All right. Rock. 
rhododendrons. I'm not going I'm going to resist the urge to start randomly harvesting things until I have some idea what they do. Won't be easy for me because my natural instinct is ooh. I'll take this and this and this and this and now I can't carry anything because I'm full. A little more in that direction seems like. I was playing a little <coughs> Nightingale off stream. In a way, the uh, mostly peaceful gathering of stuff with only occasional interruptions by... What the hell? Bad guys. Was that lightning you know, from a clear sky? I don't think so. these the people I uh, talked to yesterday? I think so. Now that people have come back to this area, yeah, they'll all so. want to be setting up places like Foundation. Yeah, I believe this was the, these were the guys I talked the to yesterday. Sports of the Ferals don't get you. The rats will. No, no, I hadn't discovered it, so this is new. Bald suits like yours sure are popular lately. How's it going? You said somebody said something about vault suits being possible? Sorry, no time to chat. Uh, and then you turn around and talk to me. So apparently you did have time to chat. You just didn't have time to chat about much. Unrefined coal. A pickaxe. Bowling pins, but they're playing six-pin bowling. I'm not sure that that's a regulation. I don't want to mess with these guys... Um, Game playing. I'm a gamer myself. Squirrel bits in the lunch pail. That is a hard pass for me, thank you. I'm trying to cut down on my squirrel bits. I mean, uh, I'm just not that nuts about it. <clears throat> uh, no, in point of fact, I have no pride and will make any bad joke. Actually, I'll make any, absolutely any bad joke. And then I'll ask if you got it. Those look like flies. I'm going to guess my gun. Probably not that useful against flies. Oh, I'm going to take that back. Bees. I'm guessing bees. Or possibly wasps. Nature's assholes. The wasp. That is a big honking mushroom. We've got a uh, restroom. Quite lovely, really. Whoops. I've discovered Anchor Farm. We have a very nice box. We've got uh, the multi-headed critters that are just mildly disturbing. Ooh. New Expeditions team created. The Man 1086 is inviting all players. Bonus XP for completing stuff. Well, I got their own little workshop. That's always nice. I'm not going to steal their stuff. Although I don't know if they can actually, like, it'll change their opinion of me, but, uh, you know, Skyrim, they don't like it, so. I would like to knock on the door, but, uh, there's no mechanic for that, I don't think. More crafting stuff. Howdy, anyone home? Other than the cows? Oh. Is she sleeping? Oh, pardon me, ma'am. You... You 
You should go. You'll get me in trouble. Uh, with who? Hmm. Okay. That's slightly worrisome. Ah, sir. Daniel. Plenty of unclaimed space up the road. Maybe you should give it a visit. You're not very friendly, sir. Heard you might have had some dealings with the gang up at West Virginia Lumber. West Virginia Lumber? No. Don't know anything about them. Now, I'd like you to leave. Okay, let's see. Uh, you sure? Because you started sweating when I mentioned them. I know you're on something. Uh, we're all friends here. Just tell me what you know, and I'll get out of your hair. Yeah, we're all friends here. Just tell me what you know, and I'll get out of your hair. You'll go. Fine. We worked out a deal. Supplies for protection. What do you need to know to leave? Tell me uh, about this deal you worked out. Once a month. Food, ammo, scrap. Murray and me take it up to the mill ourselves. Gave us a password to get in. Blue Danube. Blue Danube. That's a little highfalutin. Any idea how many people in the gang? Plenty. A dozen, minimum. They don't let us in the main building, so I can't say how many were camped out in there. Any idea where these guys are from? Bunch of cons from back east. They're not crazy, though. Not like the Blood Eagles or the Scorch, say. You can reason with them. They don't know how to farm or hunt. We do. So we worked out a deal. You have something you can offer them, you probably can too. I'm going to kill those guys. You can start giving those supplies to me instead. No, no, no other questions. Then by all means, beat it. Unless there's something else. You've, you've been quite warm and welcoming. You trying to get rid of me? Trying to let you know you're trespassing. Free to leave whenever you like. Look, I'm not supposed to be talking to you, but the nearest Tonka Ocean is 300 Bye. miles from here. Someone really dragged that anchor all this way? A fancy hairbrush. Oh my. Tempted to just lay down in their bed just to piss them off. But I won't. Fat Body, you're going to start the series? Let me know what you think. I'm going to check out episode two after I stream this evening. Uh, doesn't look like a purified water. Uh, I mean, I don't want to... He, he gave me the information he had, and that's fine. I'll move along. I'm not going to steal from him. Am I not a generous god? Uh, speak to the scrapper at Tyler County Fairgrounds. I had a buddy say, good as Last of Us, and I'm like, those are big words. Yeah, I haven't seen Last of Us. I watched the first episode. Um, certainly, the reviews on that were great. The first episode uh, of, uh, I won't go into any spoilers, of uh, Fallout... Uh, is has less humor than the trailer would suggest. Not that it's completely humorless, uh, uh, but and unsurprisingly, is kind of dark at times. Well, let's make that the only active. Well, okay, I got one big one for you. So, um, nuclear war curse. I know, I know. I sh I, I, that's a big one. I, I ruined it for you. The whole. The whole damn thing is just ruined. Yeah, yeah. It takes place in 2077, which is the main storyline. It's an alternate uh, universe wherein... Uh, after World War II, essentially... The uh, atomic age inspired scientific advancement and peace until the late 21st century, at which point resources started drying up. And uh, my understanding is it was a U.S.-China war. That, that of course, could never happen.
like the trailers, kept telling yourself there's no way the show will be as good as the trailer. Uh, I, like I said, the trailers had a, had a significant emphasis on the humor and sort of zaniness. Not a lot of zaniness in the first episode. We have, we have, oh, oh, you little bastard. Holy crap, lots of Not going ideally. <clears throat> That's two of them. Good thing there's only a whole shitload of them left. How did his body get all the way over there? Oh, I see one. Nothing to lose your head over, friend. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. Raider scum. All right. Not sure if they got him or I got him. Not sure it matters. That's a weird doohickey of a machine. All right. Pipe wrench. Torque end rod. Blow torch. Dish rag. Tube flange. I I'm trying to cut down on my tube flanges. A Braxo cleaner, huh? Ooh, we've got a, ooh, we've got a locked chest. I'll take the nuka. I'll take the nuka cola. After. Pretty sure I ain't just hearing shit. There's nothing in the safe. You'll run out of ammo sooner or later. What the hell? Where did you come from, Raider scum? Go ahead. Um, I only started playing again last night. I played it a couple of years back and I had issues with the uh, user interface. The user interface I'm having less of a problem with this time, so that's a plus. 
Um, but I haven't gotten very far in, so I don't think I can give a fair assessment. My opinion last time was that the game seemed like it was pretty good, but the UI drove me crazy. Um, the UI is still driving me crazy, but I'm managing this time. And yes, Fat Body, there is an awful lot of stuff to choose from. That's kind of what they do with these games, whether it's a Fallout game or uh, a Skyrim. What you hated was the storage is attached to a sub. Is it? Ooh. I'm not sure when you played. It's possible things have changed, that body. Again, I have the day to comment on anything I haven't sufficiently experienced or played around with. The toolbox or whatever it was called. Yeah, I'm not sure. But I know the UI is bad. The rest of the game so far has been fine. But then, uh, as an old man... One of the issues you have with a UI is if a if a an element of a particular game is bad, crafting is bad in this game. You say crafting is bad, and that's the limit of it. But if you say the UI is bad, pretty much everything in the game at least touches on the UI, and so that it degrades the quality of everything at least a little, because it's a it's a constant thing. But, like, uh, since we're in the early game, <coughs> it's too early for me to have any sort of cogent comment about the gunplay. The gunplay seems at least okay. Uh, the functionality on the VAT, or VATs, I'm not quite uh, sure of yet, so I can't really comment on that. Compared to the, um, the single-player game where the, the VATs is pretty obvious how it works view on the port to PC was just carried over to use another controller. Yeah, and, th and those hire one PC UI guy who knows what he's doing. That's all it takes. Should be down there. I don't see a Ferris wheel anywhere, though. Yet. Oh, there's a Ferris wheel, guys. I spoke too soon. New miscellaneous quest. Truck quest from the Pip-Boy. We'll worry about that later. Tyler County Fairgrounds, medical supplies, vending machine. Uh, okay, so for caps I could buy stuff. I don't have a whole bunch of caps. But it's nice to know that I could buy some more Healy stuffs. That is a Scorched Wanderer. I wonder how many bad guys I can expect. I'll take the duct, duct, duct tape. Uh, Scorched and Legendary Cultist Tech High Priest. I'm pretty sure I do not want to fight him. At all. I will also uh, note... Oops. Then it seems a bit odd that, you know, and this is in essence a starting zone, even if I'm level 20. I think it, the stuff all scales to me. Or basically, I scale to it. So the low-level players who I see wandering around, um, in essence, face more or less the same challenge. I'm not sure you really need a legendary NPC in a, what amounts to a starting area. I'm not sure that's welcoming. We've got a, he's another legendary cultist high priest. And they didn't even have, like, the crown icon next to their name. They have a star icon next to their name. You know, 
I'm pretty sure I really don't want to have any dealings with any legendary bad guys. Tickets! Free war money. Sure, why not? A, a scorched wanderer. Oh, we've got a petrified corpse. Sorry. Radi oh, it's radiation, damn it. I'd forgot the other guy I did similarly with. Oh, that's a scorched wanderer. You see, now that's the vat's noise. I'm not hitting him. So the vats didn't actually do anything other than make a little noise. Just us. Just us indeed, my friend. Well, actually, probably not actually my friend. I, ha I hate to judge. Do not mess with the... Uh-oh. Scorched Wanderer. Shot. In the melon. <gasps> Somebody's shooting. At him or at the building. Hey, it's Halloween, guys. Skip the short hunting rifle. I only hunt... Um, oh, iguana on a stick. No thanks, I'm good. I just ate. Nice of you to offer, though. Thanks. A pickaxe. But I've got guns. Of course, guns make noise. At some point, I'll probably want to pick up a melee weapon so that I can, you know, bushwhack appropriately. somebody and it sounded like it was from my left <clears throat> up there he is <clears throat> sir we're gonna have to ask you to um, stop firing your weapon this is a can this is a fairground sir Legendary cultist high priest. No, I really don't want to. I don't think I want to do it. Have anything to do with him at all, you know? He's dead, Jim. It's definitely the best fair in the county. What am I looking for here? Golf balls? Probably not. His eyes burn like fires in the night, and no enemy will escape his sight. Excuse me? Again, he's labeled legendary. I'm not legendary. I'm barely airy. The scrapper at Tyler County Fairgrounds. I didn't see a scrapper. There didn't appear to be any scrapper in that immediate vicinity. There was a legendary dude.
giddy up buttercup back leg and a blue bandana. How close am I? I mean, it is, it looks like it's the roof of the jar toss. Is where I'm trying to get to. That's certainly what it looks like, isn't it? Whoops. Is he chasing? No. So, uh, it doesn't look like whatever it is I'm supposed to do with uh, the scrapper to speak to about information about the gang leaders uh, is something I can do. So, is that the actual, that's the kill the gang leader, or... Wrong way. Right way. See if we can't talk him into uh, having him stop sending people over to the wayward. Or kill him. My expectation is if I try to kill him, one of us ends up dead. But if I had to put money on it, I'd put money on him dying, because if it's me who dies, I don't collect the winnings anyway. Really wouldn't be much point in betting on him. I was playing uh, a little Nightingale earlier, and you can certainly run a lot further on your stamina bar than you can here, at least at my level and my stamina. I'm guessing that's their icon up there. That's their guild logo, so to speak. The skull in uh, what looks like crosshairs. It's very 14-year-old. Um, I'm scanning. I don't see anybody wandering about. Fencing. WV Lumber Company. Some more experience pointies. We always want experience points. We need experience points. We love experience points. What is it? Got a delivery. Lead and lots of it. Tempting, but no. Oh, yeah? What's the password? Blue Danube. 
luck plus four. Uh, the password, which I definitely know, is uh, Blue Danube. Attack, I think it's see you in hell. Butternut squash. Wait, did you say password or safe word? <laughs> Butternut squash. A, a universally recognized safe word. Go on through. sec I want to see how to holster my weapon holster 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 there's I don't see one good evening and welcome Aim block Activate, ready, reload. And that's well, here we are. Quite welcoming, weren't they? Sorta. Of. Not really. Just gonna poke around a bit, you know. They don't have ice in their ice cooler. Well, what's the point in an ice cooler if it doesn't have any ice? Ooh, power armor. Fusion core is non-functional, which is probably a good thing because, ooh. I'll offer him some whiskey. Although it sounds like it might be risky because I'm so handsome he might start feeling frisky. That's all I got. Okay, he's a free radical. Really? The Free Radicals? Are you are you kidding me with that name? Oh my god. Organic chemistry. Oh, it comes back. The pain! Uh, in college, when I was trying to figure out what I wanted to do with my life, and taking various classes, a lot of science classes, uh, one of the classes I took after doing quite well in chemistry is I took organic chemistry. And uh, in one of the tests specifically about free radicals, the free radical equations, uh, I got 3 out of 125. That's 2.4% on a midterm. That was humbling. Now, mind you, on the previous midterm, not only did I ace it, I was the only person in the class who got the... Um, nuclear magnetic resonance spectroscopy part of the exam. Not just right, but a perfect score. So the professor was really confused. And he said, how could you do this bad on the free radical? I said, I just don't get it. It just, bonk. If you can hear it hitting my forehead and falling onto the floor. Three out of 125 points. So that was the end of my organic chemistry class. Damn, that's a fine looking character. Cigarette carton. Jukebox. I've been doing so well in chemistry too. A similar but not quite as severe thing happened with differential equations in math. Okay, nowhere near as severe. That's another free radical. Don't Court do anything stupid. I wasn't planning on it. Okay, you're watching. I always feel like she's watching me. 
Bird one on a stick. Ooh, a fire axe. That would make a nice, um, you know, weapon. Brewing station. In the phrase used in the first Iron Man movie uh, from uh, his friend Rhodes, Colonel Rhodes, upon seeing the uh, Iron Man suit, I gotta get me one of those. I definitely need a brewing station. It beats the sound of silence. Use ear protection. Uh, another free radical. I got a lot of free radicals around. Where's the boss? I'm here to talk with the boss. Beds. Vodka bottle. Scattered laser rifle. Well, yeah, I'd like to take that. But I want to speak with the guy in charge first. The hell are you looking at? Uh, I'm pretty sure it was you, sir. Now, I'm guessing I could probably be taking stuff and they wouldn't mind, because I would... Boss says you're all right. For now. I would expect them to, um... You know, have some sort of notification on it the way they do in, uh... Oh, not Skynet. Sky thingy. When you try to steal. You looking for trouble? Because you're about to find it. Uh, public event. That's not what I'm interested in. I'm looking for the boss. That's the exit. It says out there. Handsome is as handsome does, you know. This will be getting tidied up tomorrow. I thought this was where I was supposed to go to talk to the boss. And it implies that it is. Spoiled meat. Gold fork. And an enamel bucket. Okay, so the boss is not actually there, despite the fact it said he was there, and it continues to say he's there. Right? boss says, I'm all right. Because that sure looks like that's where I'm supposed to be, right? Level one, new character? No, level 20. I, I used the uh, level 20 option. Those mutant things that were here before, I thought they were tough stuff. It's almost kind of sad. Oh. Yeah. I've seen people get mad enough at computers to do this to them. Uh, I, I see one of them every day when I look in the mirror. My living was fixing computers for many years. And uh, they can evoke occasional feelings of massive amounts of frustration, anger, even, dare I say it, fury. Requires skill zero. I have skill zero. Well, I, I will wait to try and um, start so stealing stuff back. from these guys. Suspects he finally managed to get himself killed. <laughs> that was a long Until I talk anyway. to the boss. I always figured it'd take someone coloring with a full box of crayons to find us our prize. That the boss? I'm assuming because he's got a. Uh, Diamond over his head. Sir? 
Sir, may I have a moment of your time? Roper, is it? Hey. You were in Three's company. <clears throat> Mr. Roper. You the one with the password? Presume someone gave it to you because they thought you could be useful. Name's Roper. Now, explain to me why the hell you're taking up my air. I want you to leave the wayward alone. Is that so? And why exactly would I do that? Well, I don't have strength eight, so I can't threaten to rip him limb from limb. Attack because you'll be dead. Then I have to fight my way out, no doubt. Because uh, I'm Crane, and I know where the treasure is. Sure you are. But if you know where your treasure is... Well, then I'm all ears. You know, maybe the real treasure has been here all along. Friendship. <laughs> Barrel of laughs, aren't you? Now, you gonna tell me where this thing is, or are you just wasting my time? Probably the second thing. I don't know where it is. I don't have charisma enough. The treasure's not in Appalachia. It's in D.C., so there's no reason for you to harass the wayward about it. I don't know where it is, but I'll find it for you. Damn right you will. But I'm a generous man. You bring me the location first, you'll get your fair share. Now get out. Yeah. Found my treasure yet? Yeah, chop, I found chop. it. I found it in the eight seconds since we last spoke. You dumb shit. Oh. Oh. Uh, I'm glad I didn't decide to try and fight it out because we've got Jackie right here with a gun that is bigger than mine, I think. Okay, Jackie, how you doing? Short pump shot action shotgun, action shotgun. Well, we could try that. Uh, Dinner fork. I can take. I can definitely take them with the fork. I can use the fork, and with just the fork and my charm, I can die. Huh. Talk to Duchess. Yeah, I don't think she's going to be overly enthused with my success. Well, I'm taking the caps, then. I'm going to grab that laser, too. Hi, Dan. Look at this place. Most of us were holed up in the pen back in Maryland. Easy to forget what outside's like. Yes, I'm sure in the post-apocalyptic world, you know, they take uh, rehabilitation very, very seriously for offenders. The hell you looking at? Hi. Are you seeing anybody? Drink to gain positive effects. Uh, so I got some um, caps and a laser gun. And not much else. Quest failed. Claim workshop at Tyler County Dirt Track. Oh, that must be one of the group ones that was mentioned. Uh, that would be painful. Talk to Duchess. Fast travel back to my camp. I feel obliged to take off my glasses every time that face shows up. 
Here, I'll make it even more terrifying. See? Told you. All right. Sorry, Duchess. You know, I tried. Kind of pathetically granted. It, it wasn't. It wasn't very noble. I know a guy who could fix that. How's it going? Too busy. Maybe later. Ooh, I think she. Uh, I think she likes me. Yeah. There we are again. Oh, that was brief. You're back. You managed to get those punks out of our hair yet? I worked out a deal with them. We just have to tell them where the treasure is. Oh, is that all? <laughs> I guess I should have specified how I would have liked this to be resolved. I suppose it's on both our heads to find this treasure then. But you did good. Shows maybe you could be trusted. I did good? Maybe. But there's still the have issue Have you been of drinking the product? Muscle. They went out chasing some unsavory characters. Never came back. They're two of the tougher cookies out there. Are there savory day. characters? So them being in the post apocalyptic long, world? Something happened. You track them down? Maybe I remember a thing or two about this crane fella. I suppose if I had taken the cannibalism perk, anyone who tasted good that I ate would be, in fact, a savory character. What can you tell me about the folks that have gone missing? Well, missing person number one's named Polly. She got, got a cracker? A in her. You could track her with your little radio there. Missing person number two goes by Saul. Those two are closer than toes and bad stilettos. So if you find one, the other's likely to Are there good stilettos around in the post-apocalyptic era? Find them for me, and I'll pay you for the privilege of getting to yell at them in person. I'll find out what happened to your people. Appreciate it. Polly's tracking frequency is 99.7. The once proud home of Appalachia. WPLY. I figured someone should get some use out of it. Find out what happened to him. If I need to find new people, I'd like to at least ensure I tried to do right by the old ones. Well, that's mighty thoughtful. Wow. I actually got credit for finishing that other quest. That's embarrassing. She trusts me more, despite the fact I failed. I tell you, some of these people in the post-apocalyptic era, they're pretty gullible. I'm sore all over. Building this place up is hard work. Uh, that's a dead group leader. You, you gonna clean this up, lady? Anyone gonna clean this up? Maybe I should have taken the cannibalism perk. Data. Try to find Duchess's missing guards. Ah, oh, that's right, radio. Uh... Let's Bon, uh, transmitter signal. Coordinates one eight one four two two seven four six four eight. Repeat active. I hope that appears somewhere on the map. Speak to Lane. I've never spoken to Lane. Uh, event Project Beanstalk. Hard work making a I'm not here. sure how useful that is. I can't see anywhere where we've got coordinates. Coordinates 1814-2274-6488. Let 
Uh, if the scorched or the ferals don't get you, the rads will. Turn that off until I can figure out. Uh, next to the wayward is the overseer's old camp. Maybe some supplies there. Let's get that one out of the way, shall we? I don't think I need to fast travel there, because I'm there. Miscellaneous quest. Check the Pip Boy. Side quest. Miscellaneous. Craft a weapon. Craft a weapon. Craft a piece of armor. I thought I did that. I did. I placed my. Oh, these are done. Those must be done. That's what those are. Okay. That side. Daily. Daily for better tomorrow. Speak to Lane. Fine. I'll speak to Lane. We'll, we'll, we'll speak to Lane then, won't we? Plan. Small backpack. Ammo, water, Salisbury steak. Blamco brand mac and cheese. Well, of course. And some sugar bombs. My stash box. I probably should drop some stuff in my stash. Box. I actually picked up some iguana bits somewhere. I, I, I didn't think I had. Spoiled fruit I picked up. Spoiled vegetables. I don't know where. That's the new stuff. Here's the inventory. Let's see. Anything else? Addictol. Cures all addictions. Increases thirst. Increases hunger. Antibiotics. Baseball grenade. Basic repair kit. Beer. We can drop the beer in there. Bobblehead small guns. Bulk adhesive. Bulk wood. Ceramic scrap. All of it. Chalk. Combat. Concrete scrap. Copper scrap. Crispy squirrel bits. Duchess's Dram, Duct Tape, Excessive Adhesive, all of it. Insta Mash. to do it while I'm using it. Medium vault tech supply package. Mentats, the, f the mind maker, the smart maker. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Mort's edutape. Mr. Handy Buzz Blade. Is that like a weapon? It's a weapon. That's a cool weapon. Okay. Nuka Tapper. Don't know what that is. Party hat. A couple of pipe pistols. A lot of pre-war money. I'm rich. Woohoo! Purified water. Rabbit hide can go in there. Ranger hat. Ranger outfit. Raw cloth and leather can both go in. What did I just put in there? That are like a recoilless rifle. Recoil compensated pipe bolt action rifle. I'm going to hold on to that, I think. Just trying to lighten my load, you know. Got a world of trouble on my mind.
that scrap kit. Nope, we need the backpack. Oh, and I gotta scroll all the way down again. That's just garbage. Small vault tech backpack. There we go. And now I have to scroll all the way down again. That's the UI things. Just bad UI things. Steel scrap. The sugar bombs. Transmitter parts, unrefined nerve, vacuum tube, wood scraps. Okay. I've dropped off a bunch of stuff. And now we're going to talk to Lane. Is this like a radiation storm of some kind? Because uh, that's not a normal color for the sky. I can't be the only one who's noticed. Oh, yeah, we've got rads. Uh, I wonder how long this goes on. Oh, I, I'm outside, so I'm still getting hit. But we go back inside for a little bit. Another day, another route away. Oh well. Am I still gonna get hit? Here? Yes, I am. A radiation storm. I have no idea how long it's gonna last, how long I should stay inside. Now, to be perfectly fair, of course, I, I wouldn't know those things if I had just recently left my long-term home in the lovely vault. More duct tape. Hi, Mort. How are you doing? Let me go ahead and listen to... The third of Mort's. No. Misc. Hello. Welcome back, lovely listeners, to Headmaster Mort's Headmaster. final tape in the camp series. Powering your camp. After listening to the second tape, you should already be well trained enough to build a generator. If you haven't yet done so, I'll wait. I do, 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 da. Ah. I do, 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 ah, screw it. All right, I, I'll assume you nailed it. Now, generators are the heart of your camp power system. Once your generator is built, all you need to do is connect it to the object that needs power with the wire. Though, be aware, your wire will need a clear unobstructed path to establish and maintain a direct connection. Let's see what we can Some say. objects, however, like simple light bulbs, do not require a direct connection. All you need to do is run a wire from your generator to a power pylon. Place the power pylon near your lights, then voila! Let there be lights! Well, this has been Headmaster Mort's Camp Construction Hollow Tapes. Thank you, Mort. Please check back with Headmaster Mort himself at The Wayward to learn more about his other exciting courses, including Mort, can I still eat this? And Mutations. Am I a monster now? Yes. Yes. Well, thanks again for listening. I'm a monster ha! now. Nailed it. Yeah, we'll sell the ranger hat and the ranger outfit. Ooh, short combat rifle has some value. We've got two of them. Why does that have a heart? One of them has a heart. Does that mean it's, like, favorited? I 
don't know. We'll just sell some stuff to get it out of our backpack. The heart means it is favorited and will show up in the quick action. Thank you. So I was right. It was favorited. Ha ha! Gamer figured something out on his own. Barely. All right. Uh, hi, Mort. Hope this deal of yours doesn't come back to bite us. Now, what do you need? I listened to your tapes. Did you now? What did you think? You know, I think you've got a real future as a producer. Let someone else handle the talking, the writing, and all the technical aspects of the job. But after that, they were rough, but they got better as you went. There, you see? You take a little bit of effort. You can be nice to people. You can improve their day. I mean, yeah, that's what I thought, too. I, I figured I'd do a couple more batches. I mean, I'll have this thing down. Headmaster Mort will be a household name before you know it. Thanks for being honest. That's now, a, was there something else exactly what I was there? doing? I was being honest. Yeah, I didn't have anything else. Some other moment. time then. Thanks, Mort. Uh, we'll see if the storm's over. Looks like the storm's over. Rad away. Rad X provides resistance. Rad away cures. Med X damage. It's just resistance. about time to eat. Let's go ahead and get rid of our that, and we'll take a healing south to heal a, a little bit of heals up. I'm feeling like myself again, for the most part. Clean up this, fix that. Oh, never seems to end. Oh, muffin! It never seems to end. wonder when they added the storms. Uh, at least I don't remember them from when I used to play. Yeah, I, I, I would assume that there is an appropriate thing to do. I, I, my guess was like hiding under the overpass, you know, the bridge roof would take care of it, but uh, I was mistaken. So other than getting into an instant space, I'm not sure what you're supposed to do. Weapons, armor. What else can I make? No. Uh, eh? No. There we are. Okay. Floors, walls, roofs, stairs. What do we got? That is... I don't know. Uh, floors, walls, roofs, stairs, doors, crossing. Turrets and traps. Defenses, generators. Well, he talked about building a generator. I apparently have the materials to do so. Let's build a generator. I mean, Mort told me to.
Got some XP there. Very nice. Yeah, I can. That's a really good idea. I will, in the future, blame Mort for everything that goes wrong. Good call. Power connectors. Power pylon. Ceiling power conduit. Okay. Lights. Chandelier seems a bit much to me. What do we got? That is a lamp. So I build a lamp, let's say. I didn't want two, God damn it. Well, I've got two. Sooner or later, I'll want two lamps anyway. Okay, so presumably I have to run power to my... Now that I have two of them... No, we definitely do not want to make... We do not want a bunch of lamps. I've decided. Power connectors. Well, if we, let's say, drop a power connector here. I'm just spitballing here, guys. Don't expect anything useful. I'm, as we uh, would say, I'm messing with stuff. Resources, appliances, an oven, stove, grill, grill. This UI, though, oh my god. Uh, a bed. I could probably use a bed. I could use a stash box for sure. Vault Tech stash. That was actually what I was. Oh, there we go. Okay, everything's in place. That was really what I was looking for, was to get that set down. It's interesting. Never really played with base power. Yeah, I'm. Well, I mean, I'll tell you what we did. It's simple, really. Welcome back, lovely listeners. We listen to Mort again. Master Mort's final tape in the camp series, powering your camp. After listening to the second tape, you should already be well trained enough to build a generator. Yep. If you haven't yet done so, I'll wait. Don't don't wait, Mort. Mort. I do, 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 ah, screw it. Good point. All right, I, I'll assume you nailed it. Now, generators are the heart of your camp power system. Yeah. Uh -huh. Once your generator is built, all you need to do is connect it to the object that needs power with the wire. Though, be aware, your wire will need a clear, unobstructed path to establish and maintain a direct connection. Some objects, however, like simple light bulbs, do not require a direct connection. All you need to do is run a wire from your generator to a power pylon. Place the power pylon near your lights, then voila! Let there be lights! Well, this has been Headmaster Mort's Camp Construction Holotapes. Thank you, Mort. Please okay, check back with so I was right about the power pylon. ...to learn more about his other exciting courses, including... Mort, can I salute this? And mutations. Am I a monster now? And thanks again for listening.
listening. Ha! Nailed it. You definitely nailed it, Mort. Okay, so, uh... Displays, floor decor, shelves, vendors, tables, wall decor, miscellaneous structures, shelters. So, wire, then. Do I have to make wire and then use it? Displays, chairs, beds, appliances. Resources, water, food, lights. Don't have to make wire. I wonder if it's uh, available in the modify mode. I'll give that a look in just a second. After I'm done scrolling through this enormous variety of things. So the modify mode, hold V. Now that, that's a handsome fella. Uh, when building, you can swap between construction and modify using the tab key. Okay, thank you. Modify. M modify. Move. Hold for blueprint. Or scrap. Attach wire. Holy crap. You. Uh, cannot place item intersects with existing objects. So I have to move this object. tab to cancel. So we need to move this one over to say here. We come back over here. We need space to attach a wire. Oh my god. Oh my god. I have been so fortunate in getting help from the viewers in the last couple of nights, or I would have shit-canned this game again. I really would have, because the UI is so not awesome. Not explained. But look at this. Done something you never accomplished. I never built lights at your base. Well, I would... I built lights... I never would have figured out how to use them if I hadn't, if you hadn't been able to tell me how to run wire. Now, I was right about the power thing, but the wire, I was lost. Thank you. We, we have accomplished this. I tip my metaphorical cap. Hold on. I tip my no longer metaphorical cap. How's it look? Probably not great. This is home, guys. <laughs> I have a home. A uh, overly well-lit home, to be sure. Store or scrap. I don't need to. I will, uh, I'll scrap it. There we go. It cost me half the match. That's fine.
Gotta say, my house in Nightingale, a little better put together. But hey, it's a start. I was going to speak to Lane, wasn't I? And I still am going to. He's to the northwest, so in that direction. Oh, man. I am, uh, I am a bit of a thick boy. I believe the uh, appropriate internet-savvy word is chonky. Actually, you do need to return to Nightingale. I was enjoying that game. Yeah, I played a couple hours earlier today. I'm, at, I'm stuck a bit in that there was uh, a guardian at the bottom of one of the locations you need to explore that I basically couldn't damage at all. And I'm not sure why. Probably need to upgrade my weaponry and the like. What I found, though, is just running around and just being in the environment reminded me of the things I kind of liked in, uh, or the things I did like, in uh, New World. Now, the game itself, not really like it, but that part really did feel similar in a lot of ways to New World. Oh, Lane should... What do we have? Uh, scorched. And more Scorched? Yeah, more Scorched. I heard something. Is he coming? Don't, don't make me. He's going to make me. You really don't have to kill. You choose to kill. don't have to. You can choose to not kill. Well, you could have. You can't anymore, obviously, on account I killed you. But I wasn't looking to kill you guys, alright? You started it. And as the old line goes, I didn't start trouble, but I finished it. I don't know what a death tambo is. A death tambourine? I'm guessing. A stick with a sharp stuff glued to it? No, that would make sense, I suppose. I was thinking a death tambourine, and your description makes a lot more sense than mine. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. It, it actually is closer to mine. Well, it's a combo platter. It looks like a tambourine with a whole bunch of sharp stuff stuck to it. Almost level 2000 Fallout 76 is an okay Fallout game. Definitely runs way better now. Well, you called it too. It does have have sharp things sticking out of it. Almost level 2000 Fallout 76 is an okay Fallout game. Definitely runs way better now. Yeah, I've had no problem with it running. It looks fine. It's run well for me. My only issue with it in the past and present is the UI. 
It makes me actively want to weep. Oh, another one. Whether it's true or not, it absolutely, completely, I wonder if the gold fork will sell for a reasonable amount, feels like <coughs> they designed the entire thing for the console UI and then just said, fuck it, throw it together for the PC players, screw them. That's what it feels like. The UI drove me away from the game a few years ago when I tried it. I played it for a few hours. Yeah, it is probably close to what happened. Really, I mean, I just don't get it. I mean, it's not like Bethesda couldn't afford to hire a UI programmer to actually take the console UI, keep it mostly intact, but PCify it so that it worked better. They just allowed us to change our Pip-Boy colors and settings. I wish the entire HUD was changeable. Yeah, that would be good, too. I mean, really. When I played it a few years ago and tried it, I think I did it for, for two streams. So four hours-ish, or, you know, three to four hours. Off to take garbage to the curb. Well, wow, that's... I, I was about to make a snide comment about, that sounds like a full weekend, but that's more than I've done with mine. But, you know, I remember like three or four years ago when I played it for a couple of days, my response is, you know, the game seems fine. I'm surprised it was such junk at launch. Now it seems OK, but I just can't play with the UI. And I've had enough friendly players of the game. Thank you guys again. Hats off for your assistance in getting me to at least handle the busted-ass UI that I'm currently dealing with. It's bad, it's awful, I'm going to talk about it constantly, but with help, I've been able to manage, so... Protect John cuts down trees, but does not require lunch or lavatory facilities. Gilman Lumber Mill. Hi, Protect Protectron. And serve. Protect and serve. That's awful thoughtful. That's more than the police do. By the way, uh, it, the courts have uh, decided that, in fact, the police have no uh, responsibility to either protect or <sighs> serve people. Off. Their actual job is just to arrest criminals. Hi, guys. Pretty cool place you got here, actually. Nice stash box. My favorite Fallout. Uh, you see, I'm an old timer. For me, Wasteland Games. Um, so I'm not sure as to how much I've done uh, outside of like uh, Fallout 1 and 2. I mean, I played a lot of those. But I got... Oh, yoinked in, got pulled in no, uh, no with heart. the Wasteland games, which were the originals. Four to five years ago, you would have been offering to join you in game. Loved the game. Uh, found it pretty blah when solo. I can understand why. I am mostly a solo gamer, so for me, I'm actually most comfortable playing solo. If you're looking for work, talk to Lane. He'll have something for I you will to talk do. to Lane. Right now, I'm just sort of checking the place out. I mean, uh, the entire world's a shithole now, and this place is a shithole, but less of a shithole than most of the rest of the shithole. A responder's job is never done. Hi, Lane. Lane Platt. Hello there, stranger. Wow, Where those are, are some years. Walt 76. One of the vault dwellers, are you? I've heard tell of your kind. Solved a lot of problems. And caused a lot of problems, from what I hear. You wouldn't happen to be one of the problem-solving kind, would you? I sure would be, Lane. Pardon. 
me using a really bad oh excuse me accent. let me introduce myself name's lane platt i'm with the responders we're a band of self-titled do-gooders around these parts appalachia's filling up fast and we're trying to keep everyone hale and healthy on. and off each other's throats a noble goal do-gooders i hate do-gooders no no a noble I goal i like to think so it gives me hope that we can one day right all the wrongs in this I've country. actually been to West Virginia. Now, there's a lot going on in this neck of the woods. More than I can tackle myself. Now, I was there for a got ferocious beast competitive the forest. occasion Creepy at Marshall and University. Caves, and all manner of people about ready to go to war with one another. And All um, that is to say, I could use a hand. And I'd be willing to pay you It was yours. in the 90s and raining at the same time. I was in a three-piece woolen suit. Most of my memories of West Virginia are being soaking wet. I don't do well with humidity. I am from the San Francisco Bay Area where uh, humidity is what maybe is important for your cigars or your... Um, wine cellar but is not something we worry about with weather humidity is a vampire that sucks all life and energy from my body it was not a pleasant week in west virginia i'd love to help why that is just terrific thank you a thousand times over uh, here's the job for today. Marshall University, Huntington, West Virginia. We've had reports that a dangerous cult, the cult of the Mothman, has moved into a cave system nearby. They're part of a larger organization that extends all throughout Appalachia. The cult of Mothman. Learning more about them will help us combat their spread. I'd like you to go into those caves and gather some Casual of team created. Inviting all players. You'll earn a fine commission for returning them to me. Okay. What are you hoping to learn from these artifacts? Anything we can. Gleaning any information about the cult's rituals. Gleaning. Nice use of the word. To ways to stop their spread and limit their influence. So how's the hat, by the way? This is a really nice hat. It's a Pendleton. And it's, uh, it's old. Because I had it for a long time. Does it look okay? Leave it to me. Be careful. Cult of the Mothman is dangerous. They'll no doubt protect those artifacts with their lives. They're dangerous, but I'm dangerous, sir. Is that a word? Cult is hold up in I don't think that's a word. West. You can look for those artifacts there. Dangerous, sir. No, that's, that's not a word. Pretty sure. Feel safe in saying. You're always welcome here. Lumber I'm just going to take a little Jack ammo because I'm going to shoot does. people. Nah. Want to lose lumberjack job to cheese. Human. Is that cultist artifacts? Now, which of those fairies was edible again? Primary directive all trees must become desirable wood products. Wait, so pressing the one button doesn't do anything? Oh, uh, okay. There we go. Now, which weapon is this? Uh, we are currently wielding uh, the short combat rifle, which does 28 damage. My 10 millimeter pistol does 20. Lumberjack Protectron works all night and also works all day. Well, let's uh, let's try it out. We'll see how we like it. Did the lumberjack, the protectatron, just say that he's a lumberjack and he works all day, works all night, and works all day? Did he actually say that? Now I have to listen. Did he actually quote uh, Monty Python? Job. Wood. Forever. Come on, Protecton. 
Protectron, do it, do it, say it again, please. Transferring excess wood inventory. Because if he quoted Monty Python, uh, I, I may have to subscribe. Protectron. Okay. Chop wood, chop wood, chop wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The other thing you said. I wasn't listening closely. I just sort of caught it in the background. And Please, protect Protectron. I admire your um, persistence and reliable performance of your duties. You are an admirable bot. Indeed. Protect and serve. And chop wood. Yeah, I know. Additional wood. Samples are unavailable at this time. All wood must be chopped. How about you, protect Protectron? If those raiders come snooping around, they're gonna regret it. Protectron, how about you? Dispensing desirable wood. Oh, I'm adding product. scraps. I'm I'm taking their wood. Now I feel bad. Uh, I mean, not so bad that I'm not gonna keep it, but bad. Finally, a nice day. You mean as opposed to the horrific green clouds of mist we had earlier? Didn't know you could collect the mats from them? I wasn't even trying. I'm not sure how much they handed me. Uh, we can find out. Feral who drank a misc. Notes, no. No. New. Not seeing it. Wood scraps, 20, yeah, so that was two. Two batches of wood scraps from them. Wild moot fruit. That sounds delicious. As long as it's the wild stuff. I, I don't want any of the, you know, domesticated moot fruit. As that stuff is just awful. to settler. Looks like my food's a little low. So... I'm going to have a fancy lad snack cake. Uh, that's got... I'm going to have the non-irradiated fancy lad snack cake. And uh, some purified water. Yeah. If we're going to be fighting, and we're probably going to be fighting... All right. I've increased my stats. That yeah, that looks like a cult. We're like yeah, I'm I'm feeling cult. Organ Cave South. Organ Cave. Okay, that's not creepy at all. Uh, 
theoretically it should be over there. It's, it's, do we just like slide down into it? Or fall into it like that? Okay, there we are. Gas canister. All right, well, I guess we're going to go in. Uh, let's see if we can get ourselves killed for the first time. Organ cave, though. That's, that's not... It's not a welcoming name. see the presumably the items I need to get for the quest how many cultists you figure in here Grenade? That's not good. I, I I may not know a lot, but I know grenades are not good. For me. Ow, 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 ow. Stop with the fire. That's just a dick move, man. Just tell them I'm here to give them a hand and they'll love me. Well, I would have, uh, under the circumstances, I might have, except that they were hostile from the very start. I think that kind of reduces my odds. Not to zero, but um, not much. Let's see, it's A, right? I picked a lock, guys. Normally, the closest I can come to that is picking my nose, which I'm actually quite adept at. Cultist dagger, too. They won't be needing that, now will they? Diluted right away. Dirty water? Eh. I'll take those. Alright, we've got one more we need to get. And it's that direction. Nice cave they've got, though. I'll say that for them. Uh, that looks like it might be trapped. No, that's not. It's just reflection. Uh, I'm not happy about there being a fork here. Wise and holy Mothman, watch over us in our time of trial. Bone 
trunk. Whoop, disarm. You're desperate, Len That was an alarm. I figured that out. Too late, granted. No, didn't want that. Want that. Wonder glue might be nice. Whoop! Need the pitchfork. Your death will be my offering. That's awesome. Nice of you to offer to make me your offering. <laughs> See what I did there? A little bit of a humor effort. I don't, that's not the way. Trying to find the way out now. I'm not, I'm thinking I'm not finding the way out correctly right now. Where's the door? The door's in that direction. All right. Oh, there's somebody up there. That's not great. Oh, I'll take the pre-war money. Thank you. I have gotten myself lost, turned around, but uh, I'm sure I can uh, manage. Don't you think? Yeah, that's where I just was. That's not judgment. Congratulations on ascending. Sturdy leather cheather chest piece plus. I'm assuming that means it's probably better than what I've got. Flip lighter. Yep, that was a work. A couple of wonder glues, sure. Mind you, I have no idea what's actually going to be useful later and what's not. I don't need a rub cage. I've got one of those. Thank you. But because things are a little bit dicey here, let's go ahead and use a stim pack. I am not doing too great a job in finding my way out of this place. I'm almost there. Well, that's a cold-blooded killer right there. The face of a cold-blooded killer, you know? As an FYI, you can sell or scrap stuff you don't want. Sell gives caps. Scraps gives mats. Scrapping can also unlock blueprint, blueprints when destroying something that can be crafted at a bench. Yeah. Those are sort of the, my, my bases, is that anything I thought would be useful for crafting, I was picking up. So, glue, duct tape, anything I thought was obviously useful for crafting, I was picking up. And any of the uh, weapon stuff that seemed interesting. My assumption is, as I get a better understanding of everything's place, how everything works, I'll have a better idea. I was uh, selling some stuff when I realized I could. I dumped a bunch in my storage first that I probably should have uh, tried to sell, but I can always do that later. Uh, we need to go back to the lumber bill. Now, uh, due to the uh, assistance of the viewers over the last two days, uh, I am having a good time. Without it, I would be frustrated 
Beyond words. Actually, I wouldn't be frustrated beyond words, because I have sufficient words to express my frustration with games when they piss me off. Boy, do I have enough words. So I am very grateful to the people who've been piping up with help in the chat. Thanks to all of you. I doubt I would have made it as far as I have. Uh, I don't know about you, but I'm a little leery of an outhouse in the middle of nowhere. Okay. Brotherhood. Brotherhood of Steel? Yeah. Brotherhood Outpost here. Forward Station Tango. Glad you're enjoying it. Honestly, liked this game when you played it. Like I said earlier, my, my only real complaint when I, I, I stopped playing it after a few hours previously was that the UI was making the game unplayable for me because I couldn't do the basic stuff. And you guys have pointed out where the everything functions a little bit differently and, and have been able to point me at the bits and pieces everything I was makes missing. Sense now. This is my place. Do more than just fight. Well, I have found Forward Station Tango. Okay, so I entered through Oregon Cave West and exited through South. That was uh, not my intended plan, by the way. I, I should be clear, that was not what I wanted to do. <clears throat> but then getting turned around and getting lost is something I am uniquely equipped to accomplish. Yeah, I mean, I was surprised at how much I enjoyed the basic game my previous time in, but the UI just kicked my ass. I, I couldn't get past it. And it's still a, a festering piece of crap, but with help from chat... I have been able to um, navigate it so far. I would be hesitant to ever Getting so to you sick know. And tired of those thorn there are a lot of games where I say I'm I'm enjoying it, but right now there's something else I want to play. I'm going to hop out. I'll come back later and play it again. This would be one that it would be tough to come back and play again, simply because trying to relearn even the basics of the UI that you guys have given me would be a tough go. Hi, Lane. I got your artifacts for you. Trees are the enemy. Must eliminate. Trees, Trees are the enemy. Hi, Lane. Here you, here's your stuff. Sure. You're back. What about it? Is it on fire? These artifacts. It was on fire earlier. Up. I can't wait to examine them. On behalf of the responders, I can't thank you enough. You helped us make progress toward a more peaceful world. I sure yeah. wish I could say that's all the help. I, I think you're do, being optimistic. Work never ends. If you're in the neighborhood again sometime, I will always welcome more of your help. Stay in the meantime, though. Here's your payment. Have a good day now. <sighs> Fifteen caps. I am filthy rich. Okay, well, I'm filthy. Rank one achieved. Build a stash to store excess items. I've taken care of that. So Boost my score rank. Exhausted. Daily a better ends. tomorrow. More XP. All kinds of stuff. Let's see. I wanted to look at my perks. Someone had mentioned something about the perks. Lone Wanderer. That I had another Lone Wanderer, and therefore I could scrap this for whatever the credits thing was. For four perk coins. Perk coins are used to rank up legendary perk cards. Well, yes, I've got the four. I don't need the three. Oh, I know what the settlers are going through. All right. I wanted to actually look at that a bit more.
So these are the ones I currently have equipped. Uh, weights of chems, including stem packs, are reduced by 90%. What other options do I have? Uh, oh. Okay, I only have shotgunner, and since I have strength 3, I think I'd rather do with that. Let's see, perception. We've got awareness. You can view a target's specific damage resistances in VATS. VATS now targets limbs. Crack shot. All pistols are 20% more range and more accuracy when aiming down sights. Rifleman is your non-automatic rifles. Now do 10% more damage. Gain one lockpicking skill Those and lockpicking no sweet spot is 10% larger. Um, I'm going to skip that and I'm going to equip that. And that. Don't let the wasteland get to you. Glad we got those bots up and running. Endurance. Okay, uh, increased benefits from being fully fed or fully hydrated. What else do we got? Let's see. Cola nut. Home buddy. Gain gradual health regeneration while in your camp or workshop. I would like so that. Many. Catch disease from food is reduced. That seems good. <coughs> Less radiation. That also seems good. Uh, I think that's probably rejuvenated. Yeah, I think I like the lead belly. Less radiation. Weren't we supposed to get a Blue Ridge caravan route set up this way? Alright, Lone Wanderer. When adventuring alone, take 20% less damage and gain 30% AP regen. That seems pretty good. First aid, stim packs restore 45% more lost health. That that seems very solid. What are the other options? Gunsmith, guns break 10% slower, and you can craft tier 1 guns. Parts required, of course. Hack, I'm, I'm actually going to swap that out. Gunsmith in, oh, hacker in. Somewhere. got two hackers, so if I go with this, Glad we got those I bots click on that, Fixing this all by I hand can would be rank a nightmare. up, perk card already equipped, okay, well then how do I rank up? got two hackers. The hacker card only has a single star, so it can't be ranked up. Thank you. That's exactly the kind of information. I see now. I understand how the stars work. Thank you. You have explained those. So I can safely scrap the second one, right? I'm going to assume. I will await Okay. Cool. Two perk coins. Thank you again for your assistance. Hope those raiders know we All right, agility. Boy. Action boy. Action points regenerate faster. Since I want to use vats, that's you good. Up on my first day. I think the ranks with hacking are different cards. Okay. Gunslinger, your non-automatic pistols do 10% more damage. Our other options are... Born Survivor, Falling, no, Home Defense. You can craft and disarm better traps and craft better turrets. Moving target, pistols way less. Through hiker, food and drink, weights resist. Okay, I think I'm fine with that. And luck. Now, I know the settlers are going there. Psychopath! Any kill in VATS has a 15% chance to refill your critical meter. And Serendipity, while below 30% health, the work gain never ends. Oh, no. Damn it. If you want a safe haven, go to our headquarters in the refuge. In the old whites. Below 30% health gain a 45% chance to avoid damage, but I can't wear power armor. Okay, I think I like the perks now. I'm understanding the perk system a little better.
hacker, expert hacker, and master hacker each increase your skill level by one. Equip all three in order to hack level three terminals. You are correct. Why does everyone still squabble all the time? We have to come together to survive. Why does everyone still squabble all the time? Uh, I guess they we don't want you to be able to, to manually get expert and master by just using the hacker cards to level up hacker. It, yeah, it gave some useful information. I am I am duly appreciative. Must chop wood forever. <laughs> I I gotta say I like the protectrons. Oh, let's go ahead. Over encumbered. I can't. I'm over encumbered. Okay. Well then, I guess I hoof it. I can't sprint either. I'm tired. I don't have far to go. Pardon the yawn. Oh dear. We don't want him to radiate us. Yeah, you guys have collectively been an enormous help. Oh, I guess even moving at this speed is eating up AP. I see my sign. We're almost home, guys. Honey, I'm home. Let's see. The death, I, I really am tempted to start using the death tambo because it's so weird. Uh, I don't want that. So if I step away to here. Two dirty water can be Boiled to create boiled water. Thank you. Junk. So I can just sell all the junk. It lists wood scraps as junk. They're not actually junk, right? They're crafting mats. And I assume the gunpowder is. I assume a lot of this stuff is actually crafting mats. All right. Or can be converted to crafting by salvaging. Right. And this shows the materials that it can be broken down into. Gold, oil, and steel. Got it. Pretty more money can be turned into cloth. That makes sense. It's linen. For those of you who aren't aware of it, U.S. currency is actually cloth, not paper. A spine. Okay, well, I can get bone out of that. Okay, so there is a, wow, a significantly large limit, though, to the amount of stuff you can store, so that's good. I have no mods.
junk notes. Uh, inspect. How do I learn the blueprints? Is that... Something's shooting me. What the... Liberators? I didn't realize I could be attacked in my camp. Plan's gonna be used via the pip -whack. Yeah, that was what I figured. Plan for Chinese officer sword electrified. I'm making myself one of those. There's just no way I am not making myself one of those. Ever must make the Chinese sword. I didn't realize you could be attacked in your camp. Now I realize it. Ah, uh, there we go. I learned a weapon or armor plan. Plan for the Brahmin pen. Huh. Chinese officer sword electrified. Hell yes. I, I've got to look and see what's required for that. I just have to. You under you understand, I hope, that that's something I must do. Chinese officer sword uh, edged melee weapons, presumably? Wait, it didn't, didn't show up. How can it not show up? Actually, you want that plan. Now, of course you do. Of course you would want that plan. Uh... But it's not showing up. I am, my disappointment is complete. A board. I can make a board as a weapon. But that's not the weapon I want. Toggle unlockable. There we are. Okay. Edged melee weapons. Chinese officer sword. Electrified. Where's the electrified version? I would also like a ripper. Uh, I'm, I would like to, a plasma cutter. There's a mod for the Chinese officer sword. Got it. Makes sense. Chinese officer's sword. So I'll need the plan for that first at level 5 or 15. Make that and then make the mod. Got it. Well, I'm disappointed. But uh, hopefully at some point I'll be able to make myself a bear arm and I'll feel better. I don't know how much better, but better. Certainly. Certainly. Ammo I want to keep around. We just got this off of the things we just killed. Note it requires certain perks to craft it. That makes sense. If I get to that point, I'll complain about it then. What is the Nuka Trapper? Oh, I'll hold on to it. Uh, improved repair kit. Aid, let's see. Mentats. Increase thirst, but make me smarter. Psychotats. Radex, Radaway, Radaway diluted. Food and drink, let's see. Uh, put the dirty water in there. The Duchess's Dram. Iguana Bits. Mutt Fruit. 
Nuka Cola. The less good Salisbury steak. We'll keep the whiskey. I'm going to tell myself that it's a, a 22 year old uh, cask strength Glen Livet. Because I once had a bottle of 22 year old cask strength Glen Livet and it was unreal. It's also 100 bucks and that was 30 years ago? About? Yeah, about 30 years. 25 or 30 years ago. It was $100. Uh, I don't think the party hat is a really a, is a me look, you know. But I'm going to keep it. Sturdy leather chest piece. So currently my leather chest piece, let's say, is 10, 30, 4, 31. 13, 39. So it's a little heavier, but it has more damage resist and... What is the 30? Is that like the amount of stamina? I can't mouse over. Damage, oh, I guess physical and energy? Electrical resistance, okay. So let's see. Uh, put that in there. The right arm is, yeah, I'm going to, so I can get rid of that and have that. Good. Don't let me forget. We'll drop the combat knife. Wait, do we want the combat knife or the bowie knife in there? How did that vanish? There it is. Combat knife does 10 damage. Bowie knife does 12 damage. Okay. Cultist dagger does 23 damage? Okay. But the Death Tambo, I mean, come on. Ah, safe when attacked by a Chinese officer with the Electrified Blade mod, of course. And maybe I'd be able to use his sword. I kind of like the sound of that. The Hunting Rifle uses 30-08. 3-08, Molotov Cocktail. Mr. Handy Buzzblade. I so want to use that. Plasma grenades. Wow. Uh, I'm going to keep the laser rifle in here for now. The switchblade can go in there. Uh, I don't think I can use the tomahawks, frankly. Favorites currently, yep, inventory. That's everything then, right? Okay. We are, eh, we've got a lot less stuff we're carrying. We're still carrying too much, I think, but, you know. Well, it's not much, guy, but, guys, but it's home. Although those, those two um, Chinese robots that attacked, not cool to attack a man in his own home. His own well-lit home. Thank you again. Uh, I think I'm going to call it here for the evening. I expect I should be back tomorrow. I have a busy day before stream, but I should still be here for stream. At my usual time of 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. Middle of the night in Europe and early morning in Asia and Australia. Uh, I'm going to be playing more. Fallout 76, so far I'm having fun with it. I am having fun with it mostly because of the viewers helping the poor old streamer figure out the UI piece by piece. It's still a bad UI, but I'm managing with it now. Uh, and I am very, very appreciative of the help. Thank you guys for realsies. Um, uh, so that's tomorrow. Tuesday, I will definitely not be playing Fallout 76. I will be playing Guild Wars 2 because it is the first day of the annual Super Adventure Box Festival, which is, to my mind, the 
best piece of non-storyline content, the best festival any MMO has ever put in the game, and nothing else comes fucking close. It is a masterpiece of fun, unexpected game design. If you've never seen it, it's hard to describe. Uh, imagine if someone took the idea of an old 8-bit Mario... Sorry, not Mario-type game. Um, Zelda-type game and dropped a modern MMO character into it. Because visually, it's just fucking stunning. Beautifully done. It's so creative. I am... I play it. I don't play it that much because the best mode of it is also the most difficult and frustrating, and I don't do good with frustrating. But uh, the entire creation, I think, is just a frickin' masterpiece. Uh, so that's what I'll be doing on Tuesday. I'll also probably be enjoying adult leisure beverages on Tuesday, which means I probably won't be streaming on Wednesday. Thursday... I probably won't be back for this because there's another game coming. There's a game launching on Thursday. I played, uh, it's currently available. You can play basically the tutorial version of it. It's called, uh, hold on. It's called, uh, give me just a sec. Just another sec. Oh, don't you do that to me. Bear with me. Here it is. Uh, something of water. Age of water. Age of water. The first journey is sort of the tutorial version of it. Uh, and you can download that for free right now on Steam. And the launch is on Thursday. And I think I'm going to try to give that a spin. Frankly, it's a little bit Survivor-esque too. Although, think of it as uh, Fortnite visual style with uh, Waterworld as the setting and a survival, crafting, fighting game. Watch the trailer if it uh, piques your interest. I'll probably be playing that on Thursday. So that's my plan for, for the next few days. Uh, tomorrow, more Fallout 76. Tuesday, Guild Wars 2. Wednesday, day off. Thursday, Age of Water, but I hope and plan to get back to this game because I am enjoying it, and uh, you guys have provided an enormous amount of assistance with that. So, I'm going to call it here. Again, uh, thank you all for hanging out. I really, really appreciate it. Uh, hopefully you'll see me soon. I'll be back tomorrow at the usual time. Have a great rest of your Sunday night, and... Because I like to set an achievable goal for the people who choose to watch me. I hope your upcoming week doesn't suck. I'm back tomorrow. Have a great night tonight. Take care and ciao for now. Good night, guys.